Welcome to another daily inspiration by TuRomine.com. Today we are going to read from an extraordinary book, The Long Tail, by Chris Anderson. Why the future of business is selling less of more. And we're going to go into page 15. Says The Long Tail, how technology is turning mass markets into millions of niches. In 1988, a British mountain climber named Joe Simpson wrote a book called Touching the Void, a harrowing account of near death in the Peruvian ants. Though reviews for the book were good, it was only a mother's success and soon was largely forgotten. Then, a decade later, strange, strange things happened. John Crackworth into thin air Another book about mountain climbing strategy became a publishing sensation. Suddenly, Touching the Void started to sell again. Booksellers began promoting it next to thin, into thin air displays, and sales continued to rise. In early 2004, IFC Films released a docudrama of the story to good reviews. Shortly thereafter, HarperCollins released a revised paperback, which spent 14 weeks on the New York Times best-selling list. By mid-2004, Touching the Void was outselling into thin air more than 2 to 1. What happened? Online word of mouth. When Into Thin Air first came out, a few readers wrote reviews on Amazon.com that point out similarities with the best, with the less seller known touching the void, which they praise effusively. Other shoppers read those reviews, check out the older book, and added it to their shopping carts. Pretty soon, the online bookseller software noted the patterns in buying behavior. Readers who bought into thin air also bought touching the void and start recommending the two as a pair. People took the suggestion, agreed wholeheartedly, wrote more raps rhapsodic reviews, more sales, more algorithm fuel recommendations, and a powerful positive feedback loop kick in. Particularly notable is that when Crackhor's book hit the shelves, Simpson was nearly out of print. The sales data and trends from these services and others like them show that the emerging digital entertainment economy is going to be radically different from today's mass market. If the 20th century entertainment industry was about hits, the 21st will be equally about niches. And this is again about The Long Tail by Chris Anderson, why the future of business is selling less of more. Very interesting book saying that before the economy was a mass market economy today we live in a niche economy and you can highly profit from uh, having a hobby or developing your hobby and concentrating on niches there is almost a market for everything on the planet so go ahead and profit from that and this has been another two of mine daily inspiration you can download for free this audio going to turbomind.com or you can register to the podcast at youtube.com have an excellent and a prosperous day